Hey everyone, Gameaholic here, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're going to be talking about rowboats. Okay, so rowboats was introduced, I do believe, in the Forsaken Shores event. Or maybe a little, maybe it was before with the Cursed, I'm not too sure on the exact date. If you want to correct me, feel free to do so in the comments section. But uh, rowboats have been around for a while now. And again, I just thought we'd have a little general discussion because I know that they like recycling old mechanics and bringing new life to them. So today I'm going to be talking about rowboats. In the beginning, everyone was on the rowboats. I do believe I see lots of people using the rowboats. I've seen some very interesting and clever ways of using them. For example, like uh, putting gunpowder on them and then riding them into ships and things like that. Very, very clever things to do with the rowboat. So it's been a long period of time since they came out. They probably could do with enhancing a little bit. I know these are found in the in the world wild. They're not automatically on your ship. So this idea might not actually even work. But the idea I was going to propose is what about customizations for the rowboat? So how I think it would work would be the same way that you can't customize your ship if you're away from an outpost, you have to be docked or close to it to be able to change the colours of your flags, the hull, the capstan, etc, etc. So perhaps there is the mechanic there that when you go out in the world, you find your rowboat, you attach it to the back of your ship, then you can go to the shipwright and you can add a little bit of colour to that rowboat. Now I'm not saying for one second there should be some sort of method to put a cannon on there or something, that would be pretty much ridiculous. and thinking about a rowboat it's normally quite a light boat so i think a cannon would probably sink it in the sense of weight but definitely with color scheme it could be something that could be brought into the game if you have any other ideas of uh, customizing the rowboat i mean i'm not just going with a rowboat i mean you could have different colored um oars i do believe they're called maybe you could customize those in a different color and they are separate from the main hull of the rowboat so that it just gives it a little bit more variety i just feel that the rowboat needs a little bit of bit of color change and it'd be nice if you could do that as well people would then see these different colors out as well and it may even give a little bit of a heads up if you see a rowboat coming towards it then you know it could probably be seen a little bit better depending on your choice of color on your rowboat but yeah i just wanted to know if you was interested in that sort of thing is that something that you've ever thought about let me know in the comments section let me know if you actually still use the rowboats because i know some people have just now completely abandoned them because they've worked out their own methods for going over to the devil's roar which is what originally it was planned for that you pull your boat away from the blast zone which is actually quite a distance and then rowboat into when it's going off or out if the case may be and I've never really seen anyone ever do that. Even I don't do that. I just sail away when it's going off. I wait and then I come back afterwards. It seems to be the easier method rather than taking these rowboats into the raw itself. So yeah, just your general idea on the customizations. How and um, what you do with rowboats. Let me know your, your strategies if you have any crazy methods that you use for rowboats. And do they need just enhancing a little bit? Be interesting to hear your thoughts. That's it for today's video. Thank you very much for watching. If you are new to this channel, then please do consider liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing. Have a great rest of your voyages, and take care.